Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. In this session, we will be learning about the top Arduino projects for 2022. But before we begin, let me tell you guys that we have daily updates on multiple technologies. So, if you are a tech geek in a continuous hunt for latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now without further ado, let's get started with the agenda for today's session. So we will get started by understanding what exactly is Arduino and followed by that we will get started with top Arduino projects for 2022. And once we are done with the top Arduino projects, we will understand the fundamental differences between Arduino and Raspberry Pi. I hope I made myself clear with the agenda. Now without further ado, let's get started with our first topic that is what exactly is Arduino or to our experts. In this video, we will be discussing about Arduino projects. The different domains where Arduino can be used and how. Let's look at today's agenda. We'll first look at locking projects using Arduino. Then we will look at some of the rover projects using Arduino, game projects using Arduino, then automation projects using Arduino, followed by which we will look at robotics projects and health projects. Then we will look at some of the drone projects, audio projects, IoT projects and lastly we will look at sensor projects using Arduino. But before we begin, make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel and clicked on the bell icon so you never miss an update from Simply Learn. So without wasting any further time, let's get started. Locking projects using Arduino. Frequently we need to secure a space in our home or business so that no one can enter without our permission and our valuable accessories and assets are protected from theft or loss. There are many different types of security systems available today, but they all rely on fingerprints, retina scanners, iris scanners, face ID, tongue scanners, RFID readers, password pins, patterns and other biometrics for authentication. The most cost-effective solution is to utilize an Arduino-based password or pin-based system. Some of the locking projects using Arduino are Arduino door lock system, RFID and keyboard lock system. We have unlock door with knock system, push button lock system and gesture control lock using Arduino. Then we have rover projects using Arduino. The Arduino robot is the world's first Arduino powered vehicle. On each of a robot's two boards there are two CPUs, the motor board is in charge of the motors, while the control board is in charge of reading sensors and deciding how to run them. Each board is a complete Arduino board that can be programmed using Arduino IDA. Using Arduino we can create many rover projects like voice control rover, Line follower rover, gesture control rover, survey rover, IR remote control rover, and similarly we have autonomous rover and many more. Game projects using Arduino. Some remarkable Arduino based game projects ranging from retro gaming played on a little screen to more sophisticated projects requiring some assembly. Some of the Arduino gaming projects are Snake Game, then we have Chess Game, Pinball, Spaceship Simulator and Claw Machine. Automation Projects Using Arduino The robust characteristics of Arduino are well suited to a popular section of applications that is automation. The Arduino board can be used to create a wide variety of automation applications. Automation has brought convenience to whole new level from controlling room lights with your smartphone to automatically organizing events. Instead of using mechanical switches, you can now operate all of your home electronics from the palm of your hand. Some of the automation projects using Arduino are home automation and sanitizer dispenser automated shower boiler, 
automatic motion sensor trash and IR remote controller home appliances. Health projects using Arduino. Any medical equipment that has internet connectivity and can measure one or more health data of a patient who is connected to the device such as heartbeat, body temperature, blood pressure, ECG steps, etc. is referred to as Arduino based patient health monitoring system. If there is a rapid change in patient's health, the equipment can record and transmit the data. IoT encompasses everything from smart watches to fitness tracker to hospital equipment that can link to the internet. Arduino based health projects are being developed to create new medical gadgets. It may be used to measure body factors such as ECG, temperature, moisture and heartbeat. It also identifies the patient's physical state and location. Some of the health projects using Arduino are Smart wristband, Smart BioWare, Portable ECG, Ultrasonic Sight and Smart Health Kit. Drone projects using Arduino Drone are airborne vehicles that range in size from micro to multi-rotor quadcopters. A camera is sometimes included with a drone, allowing the users to watch and record the bird's eye perspective. A drone is made up of numerous parts, one of the most significant of which is the flight controller, which acts as the drone's brain. The Arduino development board is great for this purpose, especially because there are a variety of models available ranging from the tiny Arduino Nano to Arduino Mega all of which are small enough to fit into the design of a drone. Some of the drone projects using Arduino are Quadcopter, Autopilot Drone, Mind Control Drone, Guide Power Drone and Hovercraft. Robotics Project using Arduino We can learn about electronics, mechanics and software using the Arduino Robotics Project. It includes a number of project examples that you can easily copy as well as robust robotics platform that you may have to execute a variety of jobs. Some of the robotics projects are Robotic Arm, Drawing Robot, Firefighter Robot, Ball Tracking Robot and Spider Robot. If getting your learning started is half the battle, what if you could do that for free? Visit SkillUp by Simply Learn. Click on the link in the description to know more. Audio projects using Arduino. If you enjoy working with both hardware and software, Arduino is the perfect hobby for you. Arduino is a programmable, logical controller that can do a variety of cool things depending on your programming skills. Using the Arduino to make music is a special genre of projects. If you will, some are straightforward to implement while others are more difficult. So some of the Arduino projects for audio are Paper Piano with Arduino VFO or RF Generator Arduino MP3 Player Arduino Uno Guitar Pedal and Arduino Beat Detector And we even have mini vintage internet radio Morse code communication using Arduino and many more. IoT projects using Arduino Arduino IoT Cloud is a tool that allows creators to create connected products quickly, easily and securely. Multiple devices can be linked together and data can be exchanged in real time. You can also keep an eye on them using a simple user interface from anywhere. Some of the IoT or Bluetooth projects using Arduino are IoT Bicycle Radar IoT Pet Feeder, Telegram Bot, Arduino Bluetooth Camera and Smart Parking System. Sensor Projects Using Arduino One of the aspects that make an Arduino so valuable is the simplicity with which it can retrieve sensor information. Sensors are devices that transform a physical quantity into an electrical quantity such as light intensity or temperature. The different types of sensors that are available are light sensor, motion sensor, 
टेम्परेचर सेंसर मैग्नेटिक फील्ड सेंसर ग्रेविटी सेंसर ह्यूमिडिटी सेंसर मॉइस्चर वाइब्रेशन एंड प्रेशर सेंसर इलेक्ट्रिकल फील्ड सेंसर साउंड सेंसर एंड पोजिशन सेंसर मैन्युफैक्चरिंग मशीनरी एयरक्राफ्ट वेहीकल्स मेडिसिन एंड रोबोटिक्स आर जस्ट फ्यू ऑफ द यूज केसेस ऑफ दिस सेंसर सो द डिफरेंट सेंसर प्रोजेक्ट दैट कैन बी मेड यूजिंग आर्डवीनो आर टेम्परेचर मॉनिटरिंग स्मोक डिटेक्शन यूजिंग गैस सेंसर थ्री डी स्कैनर smart plant incubator and water quality monitoring system in this video we will be discussing about raspberry pi projects the raspberry pi has a wide range of uses the microcomputer has grown to accomplish many odd activities in addition to many standard tasks raspberry pi was created with the intent of allowing people to play with the circuit board and to aid in the development of new computing skills The internet is huge amount of information about the Raspberry Pi's various applications and projects as well as recommendations on how to execute them. We will go over a few projects that demonstrate the microcomputer's wide range of capabilities. This video will show you the most popular and useful projects. But before we begin, make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel and clicked on the bell icon so you never miss an update from Simply Learn. So without any further ado let's get started The first project is web server The Raspberry Pi serves as a web server for multiple users There are numerous web server packages to choose from However in the most circumstances the Raspberry Pi's performance is insufficient for reliably hosting large amount of dynamic online content Instead the mini computer is significantly better suited for local testing environment simple static websites with low visitor counts on the other hand might be hosted on raspberry pi server scanner server setting up your raspberry pi as a scanner server using sane is a terrific way to bring your old scanner up to date instead of purchasing a wifi capable scanner You can use a device like Raspberry Pi Zero to provide that capabilities. Scanner Access Now Easy is the acronym for SANE. This program serves as a standardized method of gaining access to the scanners. Xbox Cloud Gaming on Raspberry Pi. Microsoft's Xbox Cloud Gaming service allows you to stream various video games from their servers to another device. In this project we will be streaming these games from the Xbox Cloud Gaming service to the Raspberry Pi. Using the Chromium web browser you can broadcast Xbox Cloud Gaming to your Raspberry Pi in a reasonably simple manner. This project will even show you how to turn your Raspberry Pi into pure Xbox Cloud Gaming machine. The Xbox Cloud Gaming service isn't the only game streaming option for your Raspberry Pi. You can also broadcast games to use Pi using Google's gaming service. Game console. We can turn your Raspberry Pi into a retro gaming console. Also, we can now simulate practically any classic game from 1970s to the 1990s using this little computer. RetroPie, a piece of software that solves all of your emulation needs, is now available. It's simple piece of software to set up, and it also offers a user-friendly interface. You may now play old games with RetroPie. You can use any Raspberry Pi model for this project. However, the Raspberry Pi 4 model, such as the Raspberry Pi model 4B, that is 4GB, is strongly recommended. Remote Control 3D Printer. Octoprint, which is one of the most well-known 3D printing program, can also be used on Raspberry Pi. This software lets you collect statistics and even monitor your 3D printer from afar. This software lets you collect statistics and even monitor your 3D printer from afar. You can now control your 3D printer remotely. rather than using an sd card 
Aside from that, you can connect a webcam to your 3D printer to monitor the progress of your printing. You will need a Wi-Fi adapter like the model TL-WN725N to make your 3D printer work because you will need to connect it to the internet. Language Translator This project necessitates some coding and programming experience. We can utilize the Google Translate library or any other Python translating tool to make this project much easier. You will need to know how to set up text-to-speech, speech recognition, translation APIs, and so on because this project has many layers. Overall, it's still a worthwhile project that you can do with your Raspberry Pi and add to your achievements of Raspberry Pi projects. Security Camera You may have observed that different Raspberry Pi models are compatible with different camera modules. The Raspberry Pi 8 megapixel camera module, for example, is only compatible with Raspberry Pi 1, 2, and 3 versions. You may now make your own security camera for your home with this camera module. Another advantage of this project is that you can add whatever other features you like. For example, we can access video feeds from afar and have them immediately uploaded to a server for backup. A number of package or library prerequisites are already available on the internet. On your Raspberry Pi, you can simply download or alter it. Wi-Fi Extender A Wi-Fi Extender is another simple project. It's a low-cost and effective solution to increase Wi-Fi range. If you have a bad Wi-Fi signal in your garden or even your room, you may utilize your Raspberry Pi to boost your signal. It's an excellent substitute for a commercial Wi-Fi repeater. Furthermore, because this is a DIY project, you can always alter it and add new features. Because this job has already been completed by many people, you can just search the internet for the finest and most convenient way to complete it. Running Android TV on Raspberry Pi Android TV is a specialized version of Google's famous mobile operating system. It has a revised interface that better accommodates the horizontal nature of television screens. Because the operating system is better suited to wide horizontal screens and remote controls, it's the best option for connecting the Pi to your TV. The Google Play Store also gives you access to many downloadable apps. The most significant difficulty with running Android TV on a Raspberry Pi right now is that builds lack hardware video decoding and encoding capabilities. The Pi 4 Module B, Pi 400 and the Compute Module 4 are the only devices that can run Android TV. Running Zoom on the Raspberry Pi We can utilize the feature to set up meetings so that people can readily connect with you. The individual hosting the meeting, on the other hand, will need their own Zoom account. The person who creates the meeting has the authority to determine who is allowed to speak and share resources, such as the computer screen. With the free plan, you can connect up to 100 additional individuals for a total of 40 minutes. Because the Raspberry Pi does not contain any ARM binaries, it is difficult to run Zoom on it. We will use a handy piece of software called Box86 to get around this, Box86 is an emulation program that transforms 86 instructions to ARM instruction set, which the Raspberry Pi recognizes. Raspberry Pi Bluetooth Speakers You may greatly expand the capabilities of your Raspberry Pi by connecting it to a set of speakers. This project gives you the opportunity to stream audio directly to any vintage speakers or hi-fi system making them more modern. We can add support for Apple, AirPlay, Spotify, Connect and synchronize multiple room audio to Raspberry Pi in addition to Bluetooth audio. We are going to utilize a Balina image named Balina Sound to bring all of these extra capabilities to our Raspberry Pi. This instruction from Balina greatly simplifies the setup process and should lessen the chances of making mistakes. Home Assistant using Raspberry Pi Home Assistant is an open source home automation program 
that was created using Raspberry Pi based device. The software was created with the goal of protecting your privacy and retaining control in the hands of the user. You can monitor the status of all of your devices in your house with the Home Assistant. You can even automate your interactions with them. We can program Home Assistant to turn on all of the lights automatically when it gets dark and you're at home. When you cast a movie on your Chromecast, you can even program it to dim the lights in your living room. Raspberry Pi is an excellent platform for home automation. It's compact, inexpensive, has many networking functions, and consumes little power. If getting your learning started is half the battle, what if you could do that for free? Visit SkillUp by Simply Learn. Click on the link in the description to know more. Minecraft using Raspberry Pi. For this project, we need to install a custom version of Minecraft designed just for Raspberry Pi. Minecraft Pi Edition is the name of this version of Minecraft. This version of Minecraft is much older than the current version. It does, however, have an advantage. It is entirely free. Additionally, this version of Minecraft includes a Python library for interacting with the game environment. Now with that we have come to an end of this session on top Arduino projects for 2022. If you have any queries regarding any of the topics covered in this session or if you require the resources that we used in this session then please feel free to let us know in the comment section below and our team of experts will be more than happy to resolve all your queries at the earliest. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.